Hey y'all, it's your girl Sashi E. Welcome to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be doing my little baby sister's hair. So we washed her hair last night. Um, if you haven't seen her wash day routine, I will link it above in the card so that you guys can check it out. So it is back to school and we need a protective style for her hair. So what we'll be doing today are medium sized box braids. The hair that I'll be using is the Epic Pre-Stretch Hair. This is legit my favorite hair from the beauty supply store because y'all it is the cheapest hair at the beauty supply store I only paid five dollars for four packs of hair so that is a deal and yeah let's get into it so I'm putting her hair in sections because it is easier for me to work with sections whenever I am doing her hair so I'm gonna get started with this comb I always like to break some of the teeth in the comb because it makes it easier for me to part and I'm also going to use my shine and jam just to make sure that her parts are nice, neat, and crisp. And as you can see, her parts are super nice, super neat, super crisp, which is what we want. So I'm gonna take a little bit more jam and I'm just gonna put it around her, the base of her hair. So I'm gonna take a section of hair. This is the thickness of the hair. It's a nice little section. And I am just going to wrap the braiding hair around her hair. And I'm gonna use her hair as the third piece to complete the braid. And then I'm just going to start braiding. So as I go down, I'm going to start to borrow hair from the other two sections. So now I have hair for her third section. So as you guys can see, I braided it all the way down till the ends. It's super nice and neat. Okay, so on to the next. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna be doing the same thing again, guys. We're gonna take a little bit of jam and put it at the base of her hair. It just helps to make everything look super neat, as you can see. And then I'm gonna take um, some braiding hair. It's about this thick to make a medium sized braid. And I'm just gonna wrap the braiding hair around her natural hair. And then we're just gonna start braiding. So as her natural hair starts to get thin, I'm gonna start borrowing hair from the other two pieces. And then we're just gonna braid all the way down. So my sister does know how to braid, so I'm gonna put her to work. <laughs> She asked to help, so she can help. Here you go, miss. <laughs> so she'll complete the braids for me. And you guys, you can also use this to help you braid. This also helps the plait to be really nice and neat. All 
right guys, so for her hair, I will be doing the brick parting method. So when I part her hair, I wanna make sure that the part lands in the middle of the braid that is below it. So you can see this box braid right here and the part on top lands right in the middle. And it's gonna give that brick illusion. So we have three rows completed and it's looking really, really good. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna actually part her hair in a U shape. So we're gonna part from this side and we're gonna connect it all the way to the other side. All right, y'all, so we are gonna use some edge booster just to um, slip down her edges really quickly. Right, guys so we're not going to be parting her hair in a u-shaped anymore we are going to just do straight parts going down because i want her to have um, a side part uh, going this way So I wanted to mention that I do use Edge Booster for all of the braids that I do around her edges, just so I can slick them down before I start braiding. gonna do two rows but you know we got to split it into like 50 11 pieces though <laughs> <laughs> you know how that goes <laughs> <laughs>
all right guys so we are done braiding her hair what i'm gonna do now is dip her hair in hot water off camera and then i will come back and show you guys how it looks all right guys so i dipped her hair in hot water off camera so i'm gonna go in with my tropical roots moisturizing and sculpting foam and i'm gonna add that to her hair just to help with the flyaways So I'm going to go in and I'm going to add a few accessories to her hair. So last but not least, I'm going to go in with my DIY aloe vera oil. If you guys haven't seen that video, I will link it above so you can see how I make this. And I'm just going to oil her scalp. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to turn on your post notifications, like this video, comment, and subscribe for more. See you next time. Bye. <laughs> I look amazing. <laughs>